I, I think our society is getting a lot smarter when they look at television and understand that like a lot when something is scripted and faked and how we're kind of being manipulated by a lot of the representations of pop culture right now and the things that we should like and not like and what's real and what's not. Um, and we're identifying that more, which is great. But like you're talking at a time when when we broke up, that was that affected a lot of people's pockets in a great way. I mean, when you're talking about having the biggest relevant pop culture thing happening on the biggest network and you're the person who created it, your paycheck goes up a lot. And we're talking about millions an episode. Not our pockets. Not our pockets. <laughs> but you know, there's there's a there's a lot to our past politics. that people don't understand. There's a lot to this industry that people don't understand in general that always makes it difficult. And I think everyone's a little you know, happy to be here and doesn't want to lose that spot so they don't talk about it as much. Um, I think society is getting smarter as a whole and they're starting to see that more and more. But Shannon and I, this round, are just so about not involving ourselves in that. Like, we're here because we genuinely like each other and if we didn't, we just wouldn't be here. We, we both have... Too much stress we go to through. force anything else. So it's naturally... It, it works. Yeah. There's never been anything like Danity Kane. No. I don't know that it would ever work again. I don't again. think it would work again. I think people are, like she was saying, with group. Um, but I, I, like nowadays, any set I walk onto is like, okay, you know, I want you to throw a drink at this person or, you know, get really pissed at them. And, th and there's all kinds of manipulating that's just so tragic. It's such a death of like something that was really interesting. We're at, we're at peace. We understand what everyone is and was and why and how and... We've given enough reflection to everything that we've really made peace with who everyone is and, and we're happy that we ended up the last two standing together of 10 years of mm. roller coaster. Roller coaster, <laughs> to say the least. <laughs> um, amazing the fans. And we constantly hear that and we know it, but we constantly hear that too. Like they're die hard and they're yeah. amazing. You can't just turn off being an artist in life. Opportunities might might grow, they might stay minimal, whatever it is. Success is happiness. It's success is being at peace and, and having joy with where you're at and creating art. And so as long as we can keep jumping back to it and creating and we just like we literally had this discussion last night because you always have to stay on the same page just as a unit. And we were talking about like being an artist, the type of artist, like we, we basically just were talking about why we did this in the first place, what we wanted to achieve and what we wanted to get out of it because understanding that it allows you to be realistic about your expectations for the project and we face different questions and problem solving daily with this project that no one knows about and we sat down to like check back in with it last night and our, our goal and our dream was to be like authentic artists that could stay inspiring a fan base and be able to continuously tour throughout the country because seeing our fans in every city and seeing them sing our lyrics and like be inspired by our movement is is the only reason we continue to do this so like being able to connect across the country across the world is our goal it's where we hope to see ourselves forever shannon and i have never wanted to just release thing after thing that had these crazy endings that were dramatic and abrupt we've always wanted to be part of a of a unit that created an international brand. brand that we could continuously have and build upon mm -hmm. so it's not even just about it it starts with the music but even beyond the music it's about fashion it's about all type every any and all types of art so we we've literally like talked about it last night and the goal is is a marathon and it's constantly staying healthy happy and balanced enough to to make it through to come to come into this industry at, at all with you know the industry is the wild wild west right now things change daily um and nobody has any real answers and we have the biggest people around us and they, nobody has any real answers it's a guessing game and people that are in it and have more of of the opinions make smarter choices but even with that being said it's a marathon you come in it because you love being an artist and you constantly want to create and having any other expectation that it's going to be more than that will probably leave you disappointed. She